You're probably eager to see law enforcement come and take me and put me in jail for this transgression, right? <clears throat> I feel just like you. Fossil fuel industries are destroying the work of art that is our planet, and our government is firmly in their grip, doing nothing to stop their crimes. Anthropogenic climate change is leading to hotter, drier summers in Canada. So far this year, we've seen wildfires burn 37 million acres of land, emit over 300 million tons of carbon equivalent into our atmosphere, and force tens of thousands from their homes and communities, particularly indigenous communities. And it's led to the deaths of four Canadian firefighters this year alone. And that's just here in Canada. We are shocked by this disruption. We are shocked that the governments of the world, including our own, are allowing this beautiful planet, this work of art, to be gutted and burned to fill the pockets of fossil fuel plutocrats. No more. This must stop, or we will not stop disrupting. We demand climate action now. Canada must establish a national firefighting service of 50,000 firefighters to tackle the fires of years to come as the planet heats up more and more. Firefighters deserve federal resources that are out of the reach of petty provincial premiers and their cost-saving austerity platforms. We deserve a government who protects this land. If our elected leaders don't have that courage, we must establish a citizens' assembly to do what they cannot. Slash carbon emissions. Reject all new fossil fuel extraction projects. Build more renewable energy infrastructure. Save this work of art that we call planet Earth.